from getting smileys drawn on our hands to accepting our graduation diplomas. It's scary, yes. But so was walking into this school for the first time. Kuch aisa karke dikha, khud khush ho jaye khuda. The graduation ceremony is today. Can you believe it? An entire grade is leaving. I can't imagine what that's like. Year after year, we whispered these same words with awe as we watched our seniors wear their caps and gowns, deliver these very speeches, hug their families and teachers, and step out of those blue gates for the last time. That those seniors would once be us seemed inevitable, yet fundamentally impossible. But look around, we are wearing the gowns. Our families are sitting there. The boards all around say class of 2023. This moment is ours. From dreaming about what the seventh floor would look like, to realizing there's no floor above left to discover. From Friday folders to laptops and lift passes. From the old school song to the new one we'll sing together for the last time today from getting smileys drawn on our hands to accepting our graduation diplomas. Today we walked into our beloved Audi as students of DAIS. We're going to walk out alumni. It is here that we formed the strongest of friendships, loved together and lost together, where we were equipped with the skills of empathy, compassion, honesty, resilience, and determination sure to carry us far in life. To our teachers, you taught us to spell our names, then stood by us as we found our identities. We so often take for granted the time we had with you and underestimate the impact you've had on us. It is now that I'm growing aware of how instrumental my primary and middle school teachers were to inculcating in me the values integral to my principles today. Of how my high school teachers nudged me towards finding my passions and braced me to enter the outside world. You allowed us to fall down and scrape our knees and ensured you were there to help us get back up stronger. From holding us tightly in place to cover us with makeup before annual day to finally letting go of our hands today, we will never forget you or stop being grateful to you for the indelible mark you have left on us. To the admin, security, medical, canteen, housekeeping, IT, and transport staff, Thank you for smiling and greeting us every time you saw us. Your wishes of good luck before every exam made all the difference. You have taught us so much about the kind of human beings we should be. Whether we've spent 14, 8, 5 or 2 years here, how do we say goodbye to the home that so fundamentally made us who we are? To the place that forms the first line of our introductions for ourselves? To our childhood? Will our bonds remain strong? Are we ready? But simultaneously, coexisting with all the insecurities, all the fears, all the uncertainties and unanswerable questions, the following resolutely remains true for each one of us. It is time. We need to move forward. We are ready. What felt like struggling to hold on to memory slipping through our fingers feels different now. We are not losing our relationships. We are not losing a home. We are simply making room for our lives to intersect with those of more people, to find more spaces to call home that will one day grow as special to us as this one. It's scary, yes, but so was walking into this school for the first time. Within this auditorium, I see people who have the drive and power to change the world. Every single person here is an inspiration. And I cannot wait to watch you conquer the world. Kuch aisa karke dikha, khud khush ho jaye khuda. Ask yourself, what could I be? We are ready. Thank you.